He said you were talking about fear. And I was interested because at that time I was plagued by fear. Every night when I went to bed, I'd take my worries along with me and I couldn't sleep. And they actually got to be terrifying. But in that sermon, he said, you told about a friend of yours from Albany who had a technique because he had the same disease. And that technique was to put a chair by his bed, pull it up close to his bed, and an image Jesus as being in that chair. And he thought that he had a right to do that because Jesus had said, I will be with you always. That meant in Albany, New York, on any night, he could be with this man. So he said, I put the chair there by the bed. And when I get to worrying, I just say to Jesus, let me go to sleep, dear Lord. And you take care of this till morning, won't you? And, and I would go to sleep. Well, said this man from out of town that I met out in front of the church. He said, that seemed to me like a very simple kindergarten -y sort of a suggestion to be offered in a distinctive Fifth Avenue church by a so-called educated preacher. And it seemed to me rather dumb. But night after night, I couldn't sleep. So one night I tried it. I was ashamed of myself for such kindergarten stuff, but I tried it. And I kept it up several nights because it gave me a kind of a comfort. Then his eyes missed it over and he said you know one night when I put my hand out there like that on the chair I felt my hand taken in a great big loving hand and I said you can believe that or not just as you please but that is the way it happened. What he did was to seek the Lord. And the Lord delivered him from all his fears. Now when you get right down to it, who in the world are you anyway? You're just a child. You've grown up a bit. You've done something in the world. You're a thinker. You're an adult. But in this great big world, you and I are just children. And we're worried and anxious. So just put out your hand. There's another hand out there, and he'll take hold of your hand. He says in one other place, I am the Lord your God, and I will take you by the right hand. Now, if you're left-handed, he'll take you by the left hand. <laughs> he'll take you. Anyway, I sought the Lord. And he heard me. He always hears you. And he will deliver you from all your fears. 